How are you feeling a week on from your success? How are you reflecting on that? Um, it's only just about sinking in, really, uh, to start the games on a high and then finish them, finish them on a high. It's just so, so surreal. When you look back seven days, I mean, what have you been doing with your medal? Have you been sort of looking at it and polishing it every day and make, hoping it looks better each day? Yes, for sure. But I'm back in training now because I leave tomorrow for the European Championships. And what was interesting about the team event last week is that everyone performed to their optimum level. You weren't carrying any passengers, were you? No. We all absolutely smashed the team final. That was our main goal for everyone. And for us to come away with the goal was just such an amazing feeling. Now, uh, you're local to the West Midlands. How has the Commonwealth Games been received in, in Birmingham? It's been really good. It's definitely done Birmingham really well. And for me to be from Birmingham and competing in Arena Birmingham, it was honestly such a, such a surreal moment and the crowd was absolutely incredible. Well, I was going to mention the crowd, actually, because you had success in Tokyo at the Olympics. Obviously, that was without a crowd. What was... How different was the dynamic this time? I guess it was more enjoyable achieving success in front of a group of people. Yes, it's very different. Uh, for me personally, I like a big crowd. It was really tough for me in Tokyo having no crowd because sometimes the crowd, it helps you get, get around that competition floor. And when you, haven't, when you had a bad uh, rotation, um, they bring you back up and you're ready to do the next one and absolutely smash it. Somebody who feeds off the crowd in the dynamics of the uh, of the audience. I mean, is that decisive with most athletes, do you think, who are competing? Yes, for sure. I think most athletes prefer a crowd. Um, yeah, I must say, uh, after Tokyo, it was very hard having no crowd. And so you appreciate your gold in the Commonwealth Games above and beyond your bronze in Tokyo. Would that be fair to say? Yes, it hasn't topped it, but it's definitely up there. And what's next for you then, uh, Alice? Because you, I assume you've got more to achieve in the sport. Yes, yeah, so I've got Europeans next week and then I'm hoping to do Worlds, which is also in Liverpool, towards the end of the year.